Hey y'all, Irix Guy here, back again with another uh, with another Phantom 3 tutorial video. Now this is the Phantom 3 Professional. Uh, this same procedure will work with the Phantom 3 Advanced, but keep in mind the Phantom 3 the Phantom 3 Professional has a more advanced has a more powerful camera. So you're going to get 4K and you're going to get some modes with this Phantom 3 Professional that I have that you will not have with uh, with the Phantom 3 uh, uh, Phantom 3 Advanced. So to change video mode, uh, what you're going to want to do, and there's video settings, so there's this icon here, it's currently in video. If I slid it over, it would go to camera settings. So we're going to start out with camera settings. We want to modify our camera settings. Uh, so to do so, select the camera right there as I did with that slider to the left or right, so it's under the camera now. And then above it, there's an icon that looks like a camera with a gear. Select that. This is where you can go in and do several settings. You've got image format settings, JPEG RAW or JPEG and RAW. For my purposes, I'm going to use JPEG, which is perfectly fine for me. You may need RAW and you may need JPEG and RAW. It's a matter of what you're using your uh, your Phantom 3 for. The image size, 4 by 3 or 16 by 9. 16 by 9 is widescreen. I definitely want widescreen because a lot of the photos that I take with uh, with Phantom 3 are going to be used for YouTube thumbnails. So I definitely want widescreen, 16 by 9. White balance, you can select a variety of different options. Uh, the default on mine is auto, uh, but you've got sunny, cloudy, incandescent, neon, custom. So you you know you can tweak your, uh, your camera settings for your personal needs. I'm going to keep mine on auto. Uh, now you've got image size settings variety of different uh, settings here. Now I'm going to use 3840 by 2160 but there's also a cinema 4K size of 4096 by 2160 but since I film everything in 3840 by 2160 I'm going to keep it with that for my needs. You've got some stylization options, some color options and you go down and then you've got uh, the video format you can choose MOV or MP4. I'm going to keep mine on MOV since I'm a Mac user. Works great. Uh, you can select NTSC or PAL. I'm using NTSC because I'm currently in the United States. If you mess with these settings and you feel that you didn't make them optimal, you can hit reset and reset that there. So that's those are those settings. Now if you scroll over to the right with the video, which I just did there, it's under the video camera and then I select this, now I can select video preferences. So, um, video size again, I've got 3840 by 2160, but as I mentioned earlier, you can do, and that's a really cool feature with the camera on the Phantom 3 Professional. You do not get 4K with the Phantom 3 Advanced, but the Phantom 3 Professional that I have here, you do have 4K, and you can choose between 3840 by 2160 or 4096 by 2160. So that's really 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 cool that you have that flexibility and then obviously there's an abundance of of other options here as well as formatting your your micro SD card so that's it in a nutshell a very simplistic interface uh, something you can do and I'm trying to see trying to remember where uh, where that setting is if you want to put like a grid on your uh, on your view on your viewfinder thing you can let me see where that is there's an option where you can put oh here it is right here how did I get to that oh yeah when I selected with the video here this first option says grid you can put grid lines which you can see those lines that popped up or you can do grid plus diagonals. So if you really want to make sure that shot is uh, is lined up really well, you can use that feature. I don't use it. I'm just doing this for fun, so I don't, I don't really need anything that professional, but it's nice that it's there. So a lot of cool features. Hope this video is of value. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash Irix guy. I've got a ton of uh, DJI Phantom 3 videos now and a lot more coming soon. And check the link within this video's description. You can order the, the various Phantom 3 models there, the Phantom 3 case, Phantom 3 quick disconnect prop guards, and much, much more.
So thanks for watching and y'all have a good day.